Hello, and welcome to Endless Mode. I'm Mysterious Gamer X. I'm Captain Emoji. And I'm Bunter the Bard. We are playing Injustice 2. Electric Boogaloo. <laughs> starting out on Krypton, apparently, I guess. So we're starting at the very beginning? <laughs> I mean, this looks like origin story territory. Uh, intro and Supergirl. Oh, okay. Wondering why she's running toward the danger. She doesn't have superpowers at this point. It's the house of hell. It's just how they roll. They were basically Kryptonian superheroes before Krypton had superheroes. I definitely got the impression they were, you know, do gooders from the, the outset. Uh, that guy got speared through his face. Oh, is this how they introduced Brainiac? Yeah. Ah. Oh, wow, so this is straight up Brainiac gonna eat your world Brainiac, not like. I was a computer that misled some folks. Yeah, nope. not Ultron. Like. Well. Uh, in like the, the Superman animated series, he was a computer that was like the final arbiter on things uh, on Krypton. And the computer said, Whatever No, you do, everything's don't fine. Don't use your grapple you used to kill that other guy. <laughs> but, uh. It was, it's kind of the equivalent of, uh, like Ultron in Age of Ultron. Yeah. That's what I mean. He's more directly responsible yeah. than he was in. In the other one, he was just misinformation. Did you ever notice in Age of Ultron, the movie, everyone blamed Tony Stark, even though it's no way remotely his fault? He plugged in an alien device into his super robots. I it mean, if anyone, his fault. if anyone is going to have the technology to decode that nonsense, it's Tony Stark. What are we going to do, give it to the government so they can create an unstable super AI? I know well, there was you some... give it to Thor, because the Asgardians know what they're doing. Actually, what he was supposed to do, he was supposed to give it to Thor, it was supposed to get locked along with the cask of ancient Winters. It was literally going to go in a vault where it couldn't do any damage. Yeah, well, it also couldn't do any good. You're not wrong. Oh yeah, they, no, it's they fantastic. followed. They followed. They followed every scientific uh, protocol necessary to keep things safe. And you a magic AI just showed up. That was just going to happen. It's not Tony's fault. He didn't keep an eye on it though. He went and had a party with his that friends. That is a hot take, my friend. About as hot as that crater. He let <laughs> he left the Jarvis in charge of it. Jarvis is more responsible than him by a multitude. Yes, but in an AI on AI fight, he couldn't be sure that his guy would win. Well, there was no, there was no AI in AI fight because there was no hey, AI for Jarvis to fight. The when security forces had that. I'm right. just saying he was, he was trying to discode something that could very well be some serious malware. And I know he believes in his tech unquestioningly. I'm not saying it wasn't a Tony move. I'm just saying that uh, I would argue that it was perhaps not the best. But, oh, so, Krypton, so he's directly responsible for Krypton exploding. Yeah. Yeah, we should talk about DC stuff. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Maybe talk about the game a little, yeah. DC in our DC game instead of Marvel. <laughs> so in this first fight coming up, he's going to have to, like, EX dash into a meter burn. Sure, I'll press buttons. Which one's punch? Square. Great. <laughs> Square and triangle? All the face buttons. They all punch. <laughs> well, some of them kick. And it varies from character to character. And circle is your uh, trait. trait. No. Well, for some people, it's punch. No, I won't leave you. Please. Please don't make me. I can't come I'm sorry, but these ships are incredibly you expensive. You can really only hold one person. A house of hope. Never forget that. There's something of a luxury item. Hope. Hey, well, it seems hey, how they have two of them. If they didn't, if they didn't spend all their money on space bombs, they could afford a house. Are they in a house? I'm sorry, they're launching their space pod from their house. That's a rental. It's a rent trap. They're not going to get the deposit back now that the robots have smashed everything too. So it's a real shame. <laughs> You're a silly, silly man. I try. Oh man. Tragic. I just want to say, so Kellel was a baby and doesn't remember any of this ride. She gets to see the whole thing, and there's not even an in-flight movie, or... Like, they didn't pack her a, a bag of, here's some, you know, Sudoku or anything. She gets to sit there and watch the destruction of her world, and hope she doesn't die. Like, she gets to see the vacuum of space 
and hope that their ship is good enough to survive it. It's true. That is what happened. I'm just saying, it's a rough time. In my years fighting mm -hmm. Spider-Man, yes. I've learned... Because when I think of Damian Wayne, I think of nothing but quality. Every villain is a hero. <laughs> 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 fighting crime. Spider-Man was no exception. The Joker drugged him. Is Bruce Wayne just looking like a really buff, uh, and made him boss the from Friends? Okay, so we're... So we're Superman sticking in an alternate Superman evil universe. Why. We all yep. Superman killed the Joker, blah, blah, blah. Now he's like, no now he has a taste for blood. It's like a bear, you really have to put it down with that. And the Justice League, a new man. Yeah. At that point he's a man-eater. Stop all crime before it happens. By any means Ooh. necessary. Maybe in this alternate universe, the Hollow Out song is about super. Leading him down the path of oh, oh, here he comes. <coughs> Don't do crime or he'll Our eat your bones. Oh, oh, here he comes. I like, I'm, I'm sorry, Superman's an actual cannibal in my version of these events. <laughs> My head cannon, don't argue with it. it it's what uh, happens. Actual, the actual cannibal is Shia LaBarre. They're the worst of the worst. He's Superboy Prime. Damien. Rob Cantor told him so. Oh man! No, he'd make a great Superboy Prime. Hey, movie people. Superboy movie starring, starring Chila Beef. Or really just Superboy. I don't say his name right. If you're gonna insist on everything be dark and gritty, you might as well go with Superboy instead of Superman. Well, specifically Superboy Prime. He's the one that oh, gets yeah. he's the one that gets trapped in a pocket universe, watches our universe, and feels we didn't do it right. So then he comes to wreck everyone's day, like World War Hulk style, except that he's Superboy. So how many of those windscreens do you think are just littering the back streets of Gotham? He collects them all. I mean, you know, except for the ones he doesn't, like the ones he misses. I forget, was Cyborg a good guy or a bad guy? Bad guy. Uh, bad guy. Well, I was bad gonna say, guy. I thought he was government sanctioned. Well, I mean, so was, was he a good guy or bad guy? I know, I'm just saying, like, I think it's an important distinction. I, I think he's a third faction. You're gonna have to. You know what I mean? My friends were in Metropolis, Batman. Starfire, Beast Boy, gone. We do this. That never happens again. You're right to be angry, but it's not a blank check. And the Justice League isn't a death squad. Well, I mean, it kind of is now. Yeah. There is no Justice League anymore. Okay. Batman gets to shoot batarangs. That's cool. He's got remote control guided bat projectiles straight because a bunch of cool stuff. So, I think they missed out on something. The movie Final Wish, when he bounces off of it, it should have gotten rid of the W, so it said finish. <laughs> and then, hidden whatever, they should have got rid of the D, so it'd be him. You see what I mean? Yep. Hit him they... into the sign again. Oh, will yep. it do it? Or do you want to do the transition thing? No. Wait, what just happened? My special. Oh, is this his special? Yeah. yeah. They're rubber bullets. <laughs> and rubber missiles. Because Batman doesn't kill. Oh, uh, what does the box do? I know it's a mother box, but what does Cyborg's mother box treat do? I saw him put it in the air, and then I saw a small explosion, so I didn't get to see what it do. I think he can place it on a line screen, and it explodes, used to create combo opportunities. Oh. I kind of thought it would give him a spawn point, because, I mean, the mother box can create boom tubes. Uh, that's, that's why he's the... That's why he's the, uh... Party teleport in, uh, the Justice League comic. Yeah. I mean... I think an actual mother box, like a fully functioning one, can do more stuff. But uh, the one thing that everyone can seem to get it to do is teleport. Uh, oh, it does! Check it out. Yeah. If you bounce him again, finish him. Yep, there's a Jiva for that. Really? That's that's mm -hmm. delightful. That's a fun Easter egg goodie that we have I think discovered. you have to do it in a player match or a virtual match, it, like yeah. against a person. Sure. sure. Still, that is Your glider that is fun. Need work. Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Let's he doesn't go. care. <laughs> of course you're fine. If you weren't fine, you'd be over there somewhere. Yeah, you're still moving. Attract that gunfire in your brightly lit costume. 
Also, that hoodie blocks your peripheral vision, and it's stupid. Thanks, I really Dad. Don't know why. Thanks, Dad. I'll dress myself. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, they're such a dysfunctional <coughs> family. Right. All right. So we need we need to pay attention. This uh, serious game here is going to love this next level. Oh yeah, he ain't dead. So you won't kill, but you're fine with traumatic brain injuries. Secure the loading docks. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> the boy has a point. Oh, Wonder Woman. Well, we're all dead. Here <laughs> Thanks for playing. Game over. No, yeah. Batman can take it. Here to help. From making a terrible mistake. None of us wanted this, but the Joker forced our hand. Metropolis changed the world. If anybody go kill him, it with would be Wonder Woman. Not like I mean, this. She totally snapped back some words back. Why would you think that? So her sword's more of a falcon this time around, I'm noticing, rather than like a generic broadsword sort of there. Mm -hmm. I kind of dig that. She's got some interesting things, but uh, she. I always felt like her move set's a little incomplete. Mm. Well, I mean, she clearly needs stars and stripes. Uh, no, she needs final justice. Final justice. Stars and stripes. But she's got the shield throw. Bat hug. Yeah. She's got the shield throw, which I think anybody with a cool shield like that should get. It's just on the plus side, this is less likely to kill her than it would cyborg. Mm, that's probably true. On the plus side, uh, Cyborg already has prosthetics, you can just replace them. That's true. If you, you know, blow off a limb or something. I uh, think they did a really good job on everyone's models, but, like, both in both Injustice games, I feel like Wonder Woman just looks off. I can't tell you why. Um... They made it look more like armor, and less like boomers. It's more like her face. Uh, her, oh. her little peplum skirt, half skirt, is bugging me just a little bit. It's only a back skirt, I did notice that, It, yeah. it is only a back skirt. It's kind of like only her butt got a cape. Yep. I also have to question why she carries a shield but doesn't use it except as a discus. All offense. She's a little bit hawkish. Uh, of all the legacy, of all oh, the legacy yeah, characters, Flash. she changed the most. What's that? Oh, all really? The, yep. Uh, her, her entire trait you changed. You succeeded, so you got health back, or she got health back. Because her trait was the ability to switch between yeah. using the lasso yeah, and the sword and shield. Oh. That well, sounds cool. Probably, like, uh, Superman and Batman remain almost unchanged. And Green Lantern. Oh. Well, that's the only thing that neutralizes her powers. Where is he? Let's see, you're at Arkham Asylum, Joker blew up Metropolis. Where do you think he is? <laughs> you can't turn your back on him. He needs you. Hi, That's Sean. I came. Cat. I'm trying to stop him from making a catastrophic decision. I'm not going to, because this is a flashback. <laughs> Meanwhile, uh, Isaac is trying to keep Sean from making a catastrophic decision and eating a microphone. Meow, meow, meow. Doc, what are they gonna do with us? Where are we going? I ain't going nowhere till you tell me what's happening. Get back in line. Huh. Now. Now. I was gonna say it seemed like a horrible idea to leave so little security, but I guess if Superman's there. You just sort of assume everyone's gonna fall in line so they don't get their head melted. Yeah. Two minutes. Oh, remember the gold trim on the cape. This is evil Superman. This is oh, like yeah. this is like Emperor Superman. That's true. Cal Emperor, if you will. Oh, this is actually oh, man. that. Oh man, can, flashback. that's true. Can we can we name it that? Can we call evil him Cal Emperor? Because that's really good actually. That's the problem with fighting for truth sure. and justice. The battle never ends. Original character you know, level ended. <laughs> First Joker. Now this. When does it stop? When, when there's, there's no, no more animals. When people can live without fear. We want the same thing, Bruce. 
I no, no. To kill my Bruce wants fear. He kind of needs it. It's an important tool in his arsenal. Like they want yeah. Probably the most powerful thing in his arsenal, actually. One for you. Don't you put that on me. What is that? A red solar grenade. To dull your oh. powers. You need to stop. Take time to grieve before it's too late. <laughs> you wow. Will... When Batman's telling you that you need to take time to process your grief? I mean, think about that for a moment. I love how he dropped the grenade in the middle of Superman saying he wouldn't drop the grenade. I have to stop you. Ouch. Looks like it's night time, and you did hit him with the grenade. So he's, he's probably not as raw as he should be. Because we all know that when Superman's uh, weak to things, that stops him from doing stuff. <laughs> well, it doesn't stop him completely. Notice he still has his move set and can fly. But, but it's usually one of those things where the writers can now tone him yeah. down to an appropriate level. Also, notice that it's not easy. <clears throat> Ceilings aren't the thing. I mean, not really. Well, I also want to point out that take him into the upper atmosphere, he's going to get some sunlight from the moon. Yeah, well... If, if, any, if anything, you just powered him up a bit. Oh, this is brown. Oh! No. I'm, I'm glad that you dodged his, uh... his charge there. I can only imagine that Superman's, uh... special is literally punching him into the sun. Uh, it's actually less lethal than Taurus. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? I was yeah. going to say, she does a slingshot around the sun, so... Yeah. I assume he punched you through it, and then on the other side, he, like, punched the molecules back into your shape, and then punched that to Earth? <laughs> that's more like a Dr. Fate thing. <laughs> that's a magic. Well, Superman's powers are magic. He shouldn't be able to stop a bus or a plane that's flying at him, which should crumble around him, and he ends up on the other side. Okay. He dampened the inertia of things, I guess. Oh, that's uh, a fight I'm supposed to win. If yeah. if you'd like to, uh, you can press options and look at your move list. Eh. I'm kind of recording. Alright, alright. <laughs> Just needed to lull him into a false sense of security. Exactly. <laughs> There I am, Batman, beating up <laughs> Superman in a fist fight like that's ever happened. Just, just, um, just, just one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two. Which one's one? Square. <laughs> <laughs> Doing pretty good. I like that he uh, throws a smoke pellet and comes back. It's uh. It's not how ninja ing works, but okay. Yeah, well, he failed out of ninja school. He kind of did, actually. He blew <laughs> up the whole dojo and all. But he doesn't kill people. Yeah. He threw bombs into the armory and it all exploded. Nobody died. He wasn't Batman, though. <laughs> That's the technicality you want to ride on. <laughs> well, to be fair, his whole code rides on a lot of technicality. I didn't kill you, Grant. <laughs> I'm not gonna kill you, but I don't have to save you. <laughs> uh oh. Not the smartest choice. So how do you win these? Uh, bid more than the other guy. Oh. Yeah, at the bottom you have a bar, which is can... a problem when you don't have more than the other guy. Because well, he can just bid all of it. Clashes do three things. They reset the positioning of the characters so that you can break combos with them. Sure. If you initiate a clash as the attacker mm -hmm. and win, it deals damage to the defender. Okay. If the defender activates a clash, which is what happens 99 out of 100 times, uh, and they win, they get health back. Mm -hmm. 100. Really? Zaz? That's who we're, that's who we're cutting out here? I thought he had more check marks on his skin. Sounds incorrigible to me. I didn't get to see the rest of it, but he just doesn't seem to have a whole lot on his face. You'd rather fight your friends than the real problem. I'm warning you, son. Oh. son. Oh, no. You didn't raise me. The League of Assassins did. <laughs> <sighs> Problem solved. Okay, so I'm already where did you go, Mental? 
Damn well, he started out mental. This is a line we do not cross. Then stay on oh, your side, oh, he Batman. just crossed it. I'll be on Superman's. Man. Yeah. Almost had this whole Superman thing put to bed, and then. Damn. Yeah, well, Damien's a little punk. He is. He really is. I, I know that a lot of folks really didn't like his arc. Like, enough so that uh, I think DC, like, outright killed him at one point. Uh, but they've relaunched again, so he's probably alive. Now. I haven't been keeping track lately, to be entirely honest with you. No, oh, that's what that was. I do feel like one could spend a lot of time in training just finding out what all of the things in the rooms do. Yeah. It's like another character you have to learn is, hey, what does that do? Uh, also, like, because there are, like, unofficially three types of characters, mm. and they interact with certain things differently. Okay, so, Cyborg, Wonder Woman, and Superman, sure. The boy. <laughs> he is wearing a suit the Batman made, it might be... Missile proof? <laughs> really good. <laughs> it's not missile proof. He took damage. Missile, missile resistant. resistant. <laughs> missile resistant. Um, and remember, it's a rubber missile. It's a rubber missile. <laughs> it's oh, it's a giant. It's a giant Green Arrow boxing glove missile. Yeah. Plus, he. Uh, he clearly has the uh, the cape there to like oh. absorb fall uh, damage. I've never seen his super. Well, it's because it's Damien and he's he's a punk. Oh, so close! Oh, hard oh. <laughs> <laughs> wheelchair. I would have had it. <laughs> it seemed that super wasn't wheelchair accessible. Uh, Okay, so this battering kind of whoops off screen and comes back. Or... It's a smart birdering. It homes on the opponent. He's a smart bird. You don't bird. get to throw that gurney. Alright. And he gets an S word, but we don't kill people. No. Nobody. Nobody dies from any of this. Oh, it's 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 Rooney Kenshin. It's totally one of those reverse blade swords. Right. That's why he had to use the the Robin Arag to kill Zaz. Yep. <laughs> Otherwise, he would have had to hold the entire sword backwards. That's just awkward. It's a sword that only cuts in one direction. Yep. So like, Damian Wayne was like literally one sociopath away from just becoming a murder hobo. Why is he running around with Batman? I know, right? <laughs> because Batman was hoping that he could reform him. No, like, but why did Damien stay? It's not like Batman could have stopped him from leaving. At any point during this, he could have gone and killed himself as a psychopath. Yeah, like... Who says he doesn't? Maybe he That's just true. does that on weekends and doesn't tell Batman. That could be. After Batman goes to bed, he goes back out and kills a couple of thugs. <laughs> <laughs> Batman going to bed. <laughs> well, you know, it's three in the afternoon. When, when, when Bruce Wayne's at a board meeting. <laughs> and he's learned enough detectiving stuff, he knows that if he kills a random person that he has no connection to, there's very little to tie him to the murder. Rubber bolts, rubber missile, rubber ground. I have rendered him unconscious. <laughs> the rubber missile, and rubber ground. I never meant to. That's rubber what, gravity, rubber Fulton system. That's yeah. what the keep's for. We missed it, but it inflates into one of those fall bags, like from the Stuntman movies. How dare you bring up Jason? You don't bring up Jason Todd. Let's go. Jason Todd was more of a son than you are. Not today. <laughs> That's funny that you say that. I saw the game trailer. Uh, uh, so Spoilers. Game trailer for Red Hood, right? Mm hmm. <laughs> Spoilers! Not everybody knows that Jason Todd is the Red Hood. Uh, uh, I think we might have hit the statute of limitations on it. It is decades old. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Years just being 
And, and I was actually making light of some commentary that happens between Batman and Damien. So, when you play is horses? he, like, a mayor or something giving this speech, or... Uh, no, but he is Batman Bruce Wayne. Oh, oh publicly yeah, Batman. He's publicly, he's publicly Batman, because they outed him in Injustice Uno. Oh, right. Thought that's why you hired that overpaid PR firm, Lucius. Convincing folks to move back to these cities is a lot harder when they're afraid someone's going to... I know they couldn't afford him, but I'm really sad that Lucius, uh... I made that clear. Wonder Woman isn't uh, the same which is from the movie. There somewhere, and seemingly yeah. Well, yeah. I know you built Brother Eye to keep tabs on all those loose ends. Still, the the, the VA does an excellent job. Not, not critical. Not knocking Our enemies can't find out, something but. they don't know exists. Well, then at least follow one bit of advice we paid those PR people so much money for. What's that? Be a little less Batman, a little more oh, a little bit. Playboy. Get out around town in the daylight and smile. Focus groups show people feel safer when they see you smile. Hmm. Yeah, there's an aspect of Batman I hope they bring back. The one where he can at least pretend to be a billionaire playboy. Oh, you gotta get Kevin Conroy for that. Yeah, you do. I loved his just, I loved his Bruce Wayne voice. Can like, we I know just, it's weird, but... Can we just take a moment to appreciate that, like, every night he has to get out of that suit with a crowbar? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this looks like shenanigans. Reception area. This place needs a lot of work. Dinah, Oliver, thanks for coming on short notice. You're lucky we found a sitter. Wait, do they have a kid? Yeah. I mean, I know there are a couple, but are they gonna have a kid after the game's over? That's the question. So, uh, mm. uh, they're from Earth One. Mm. What? Well, yeah, because uh, Earth 2 Ollie is, uh, he got knighted. Yeah. He told yeah. Superman that he was being a jerk. Underground. And Superman's like, I'll choke you a jerk! Yeah, he <laughs> superman him. So, why are we still meddling in uh, other universes? That, that just doesn't work out very well. Well, it saved the this oh universe in Injustice One. It saved yeah, this universe from Superman. But it kind of put the other universe on target for other Superman too. That's true. Linking every Our universe is the only one of consequence. On the planet. It warns us when to, uh, yeah. to quote Teal from uh, Star Troubles here. Must take a real genius to operate. I don't know about genius, but I do got a PhD. That is true. China, China puppy. A world away, but the terrifying scenery is nice. She shouldn't be in charge of that. You shouldn't be anywhere near anything that requires well. stability. So, what's up? Yeah, <laughs> she's a good guy now, and I will yeah. have none of your bad guy Harley Quinn naysay. Good guy is fine. <laughs> I'm in not... charge of a system is not. <laughs> I'm not saying. I'm not saying that she isn't trying to do good. I mean, I think Harley the really back of her does. coat has a bat symbol on it. It's up. She's officially Team Batman. I just... If she has a bad day, and forgets to take her meds, I, I could see us accidentally, like, having a Rick and Morty situation. Yeah. We're talking about multiple universes here, I'm just saying. Good thing I packed my bug spray. I need you three to stop that crash. I'm just picturing, you know, <laughs> she is actually very smart, and there's a lot of bat tech there. I'm picturing her 3D printing a portal gun like Rick and Morty and being like, you know, going on adventures when they're not around. A lot. I mean... But you really trust Harley? She's a different person since Joker died. Mostly. Okay, I liked his tone there. <laughs> Like, talking about the Bruce Wayne voice. He was, he, I think he even smiled a little bit. He was like, people like it when I smile. Focus groups. <laughs> well, we will do chapter two next time. On Endless Mode. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you like what you see.